Welcome back to Terraforming Mars. This is it, the finale. I'm going to finish it off. we got two generations to go. I think we're going to pull out the win. All right, so the first thing we do is, of course, off the top of the deck, we take one, two, three, four cards, and we want to see if we want to spend three mega credits a card to keep it. We're sitting at 47 mega credits right now. We have a robotic workforce. Uh, don't need it. We're not going to worry about it. Ganymede Colony. Once again, don't need it. Not going to worry about it. We're looking for energy and heat. And I'm just not seeing energy and heat. So we're just not going to spend any money on any of those cards. Not going to worry about it. All we need to do is raise the oxygen level once. All we need to do is get two of the water tiles on, on the board. Raise the temperature one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times for the win. we got two generations to do it. Let's go over to the production area. Uh, there is lots to be done. All right, what I want to do is raise the temperature three times right now. How are we going to do that? We have lots of heat. For every eight heat, so that's five, six, seven, eight. So that's going to raise it once. Five, six, seven, eight. That's going to raise it twice. And for 14 mega credits, we can raise the temperature again. So we're going to pay 14 mega credits. And that's going to allow us to raise the temperature three ticks. Let's go to the main board and get it done. All right, we're raising the temperature three. One, two, three. We just hit zero degrees centigrade Celsius. And boom, we're going to be able to place a water tile out. We're also going to increase three times, one, two, three, up to 50 terraform rating. And now we get to place a water tile, which is exactly what I wanted to do. All right, we're going to place this water tile right here, which is going to gain us a plant uh, and two mega credits. It's also going to increase us from 50 to 51 mega credits. So from here, we get a uh, like I said, one plant, two mega credits, back to the production board. All right, we're going to get one plant, and we're going to get two mega credits. All right, so we now we have 10, 20, 30, through 35 mega credits, and a bunch of plants, which is a cunning plan that I have. So we're going to spend eight plants right now, eight plants, and that is going to allow us to put out a greenery over to the main board to put out a, I guess a shrubbery. All right, out comes the shrubbery, a greenery, and we're going to place it right here. That is going to, of course, give us two plants, but it's also going to give us two, four, six mega credits, increasing our oxygen by one, increasing our mega credit, our terraform rating by one. Awesome, all the way around. Two plants and six mega credits back to the production board we go. All right, so we're going to get two plants. All right, and we're going to get uh, six mega credits. That was awesome because we placed that next to three water tiles. Tons now. Uh, and what else now do I want to do? I don't think I'm going to bother with converting any energy into oxygen. I don't need it. We've now maxed out our oxygen. One of the three parameters has been taken care of. We only need one more water tile on the board to fulfill that. So I think we're going to spend, uh, we're going to look at our action cards is what we're going to do. All right, so looking at the aquifer pumping, we're going to spend five, six, seven, eight uh, mega credits right now to activate that, which allows us to put our final water tile out on Mars Let's go ahead and do that. All right, our final water tile on Mars. I guess we might as well put it, uh, where do we want to put it? Let's put it right, we might as well put it right here next to our other water tile. So that will give us uh, two mega credits. And of course we're going to increase 52 to 53 mega credit, our terraform rating. All right, so we're back to the main art to our production area. We're going to get two more mega credits. And now we have all of our water tiles out, oxygen at maximum. It's just the heat we got to worry about for the win. All right, that's going to give us two more mega credits. Wow. Mega credits are flowing like water on Mars. Now, 
All right, uh, what else can we do? We can't really do anything else. We could draw a card just to see what we can get. Uh, we can increase our heat. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to look at our um, cards again and uh, our action cards because we're going to be increasing our heat value. All right, so we are going to spend three energy here. Uh, that's going to take two away or two back. And we're going to use. Um, oh, no, I'm not going to do that. <sighs> Stupid. All right. Never mind. We're putting the three energy back because it's spending 10 mega credits. That's what I want to do. Spend 10 mega credits, increase uh, heat production by two. So our heat production goes from seven right up to nine. Uh, that's what we want to do. We don't want to do the oxygen water splitter because that's kind of useless. Uh, we don't really want to do the space mirrors either because we only have one generation after this one to do what we need to do. And I think, uh, I think we're going to leave it. No, we're not even going to leave it off there. We're going to spend 14 mega credits right now uh, as a standard action, and we're going to raise the temperature once more back to the main board. Uh, to raise the temperature again. All right, raising the temperature once more. We're now at plus two. We only have one, two, three more temperature uh, gradient raises to win the game. We're going to go from 53 terraform rating to 54. Back to the production area because I think we are now finished with things we can do. Uh, and so we're going to do the production phase for uh, generation 13. All right, it's production phase time. We have minus two. We're sitting at 54 on the terra on our uh, mega credits. So we're going to get actually 50, 54 minus two. We're going to get 52 mega credits. Yeah, you can see the wind coming from a mile away, even through a Martian dust storm. 52 mega credits. All right, we don't have any. We've never had any iron or titanium uh, building. Uh, we do get three plants, which are probably not going to matter much. And all of our energy goes to heat, which I kind of do now, I guess, is the time to do it. <clears throat> we get 11 energy, which is probably not going to do us much for the final uh, countdown. We get nine... <clears throat> nine heat so we're going to take one away we're going to put a 10 in there all right love it and that is going to conclude basically generation 13 so up last for this episode and for our playthrough will be generation 14 back to the main map and uh, let's have a final generation we have this generation the terraform mars for the win and i can see we can do it easily now all right so here we are it is now generation 14 so we have this turn basically to get the heat bumped up three more times for the win we do get to look at the top four cards off the deck see if we want any nah i, I don't think we want any we just ooh, heat trapper hmm decrease heat production to no we're not going to do anything Back to the production board. I think we are just now going to pull out the win. Okay, well, very simply, all we need to do is raise the temperature three more times to get us to plus eight. <clears throat> and for every eight here, we can raise the temperature one. So we're one away. We have two, four, six, seven, but we have 16. So by spending 16 heat, that raises the temperature twice. And by spending 14 mega credits we can raise the temperature once more so away we go we have just raised the temperature three times i think we just pulled it off i think we terraformed mars right on uh, the 14th generation all right well we have pumped up the temperature one two three times we're at plus eight we got all the water tiles out we're at 14 percent oxygen this would go one two three to 57 I just wanted to end the game off here. We won. Wow. It was looking a little dicey there the first seven or eight generations. But then our heat engine got running and wow, smashing those asteroids into Mars and dumping Deimos into Mars really helped us out. 
So this is Terraforming Mars. That was solo. And again, we were using the Beginner Corporation, which gave us 42 mega credits to start with and 10 free cards. That is not the way it happens when you play with any of the other corporations. Will I be doing another playthrough solo? Yes, I will. But I'll be using one of the other corporations, not the beginning one. So I hope you enjoyed it. I uh, hope I haven't messed up too many rules along the way or left notes. Check the comments as well because sometimes I do things incorrectly. You have to check the comments. So thanks so much for watching along. Thanks for your comments, your subscriptions, and your likes. Very, very much appreciated. Join me next time for another complete playthrough series.